Good day, Domic Nation, and welcome to the vlog. It is Thursday morning, or Thursday afternoon now. I uh, got up early, got the vlog done, sent it out to you guys so you could watch that. And today I'm working with Carl. Say hi, Carl. Howdy. <laughs> so this is Carl. A lot of you guys are asking, who's Carl? What's, what, what's Carl doing? He has a fishing show that's on uh, national television in the States. Are you on Canadian TV yeah, too? Wild TV. On Wild TV. Uh, so, but I'm helping him put stuff together for his YouTube channel, which is uh, Extreme Angler TV. So, look at Sunny. Sunny loves Hi. Carl. Hi, Sunny. How are you? Kitty cat? She likes taking a seat and anytime he stands up. So we just finished today's show. It's called Spinner Bait uh, Small Jaws. So you can check it out on his channel. Um, by the time you see it, it will be up because you're going to put it up probably today, right? Yeah. So when you guys are watching this, um, you can go straight over to Extreme Angler TV. I'll put a link in the description. Hopefully, again, remind me if I forgot. Um, I was going to quickly go there so you guys can see, so you know you're, you're in the right spot. All right, so this is what it looks like. This Carl's there with this awesome smallmouth bass. It's got 29,000 subscribers. It is going to continue to grow because he's putting together wicked videos of uh, tips and tricks and how to catch a big, large mouth and small mouth bass, pretty much. And you also do crappie, which is another style of another kind of fish. Anyway, so that's Carl, people. Go check him out. And we're back. Carl left a while ago. Uh, I just finished uh, going through a whole bunch of comments uh, and replying to everybody I could on my vlog from yesterday. Uh, it was funny. It's funny when, when some people, they uh, start to watch the video and they comment too quickly. So somebody actually tweeted saying, you know, that's not the kind of shirt you wear at a funeral. But I, so I tweeted back to him and said, I guess you haven't watched the whole video. Because I explained in the video that I just didn't want to wear a long sleeve button down shirt when I went to the doctor. So I just wore my relaxing Hawaiian shirt when I went to the doctor and then changed up when I went to the funeral. And it was um, one of those, uh, what do they call it? Celebration of life things. So there was no casket, there was none of that stuff. It was at. Uh, Carol's cousin's house so all the family gathered and they had like food and drinks and snacks and, and desserts and coffee and everybody just talked and then they had some uh, very light speeches so Carol's cousin and a few other people talked and just talked about Jack and his life and uh, so yeah so that's what happened yesterday so right now I'm just walking away from my computer for a little bit. It's really hot outside, so that's why the air conditioner's on, fans are blowing. Uh, but I'm just walking away from my computer for a bit, getting the dishes done, taking a big breather, because you need that during the day. I really need to go for a walk too. So I'll probably wash the dishes up, and go for a nice walk, take Sam with me maybe, because he doesn't really walk, he like sniffs, which doesn't help me walk. So, yeah, that's what we're doing, and uh, time to wash the dishes. It is now 7.38, just finished dinner. We had, uh, I had like one slice of a frozen pizza, and we had, it's, I guess it was a cheese and spinach ravioli, and they were big round uh, raviolis, and it had like, I like guess, spinach green stripes on them and very good. Uh, I don't like putting anything on it except some Parmesan cheese and we're just gonna go over some railway railway tracks, so hang on. Uh, put some Parmesan cheese on top. Uh, and after we've strained, strained it, uh, we put uh, butter on it so they're all nice and buttery. And then I put my Parmesan and that's great. That's all I had with uh, a couple uh, Chips Ahoy cookies as for dessert and a glass of milk and that was pretty much it. So I am headed down to Bradford to exchange my modem because it, this modem, I'm not sure why, it will not let me live stream on you now. And uh, so I haven't live streamed from my computer doing a you now, which I really enjoy doing. And I want to start a system where 
I will be live every single week, once or twice a week. I'm not sure what day, and probably Wednesday would be the best day of the week for me to live stream and make it a schedule. It, it will happen every single Wednesday night at X time. Uh, I might have to do two so that I can get my um, European followers that want to chat and ask questions and, and hang out. And I'm also thinking about uh, when people do their fan packages, do them all, all my fan packages live from now forward. Uh, and depending on what they are, like uh, Johan sent me a box with a lot of stuff in it and I might as well do uh, live shows with them. I think that would be a lot of fun because uh, I can't do a video with all that stuff and he didn't want me to do a video with that stuff. He just said this is for you and your family to try some uh, Scandinavian and, and Swedish treats. So thank you very much again, Johan. So we are just, I just got to show you the sunset. Check that out. Oh, nice. Right between the clouds. Very cool. All right, so we're heading down to Bradford. We're gonna exchange this and you can come along. Let's go. I made it down to Bradford. And of course I have everything in my hands. Very difficult. Very difficult. Can't cope. As some of you know, I've done a couple of reviews at the Hero Burger. Uh, Krabby Joe's and this is where I get my Rogers stuff from I think that's about it. Oh uh, Mary Brown's is just around the corner So I've done a lot of food reviews in this area Of course McDonald's is down the street And we're back in the car got my modem. This is uh, made by Hitron or Hytron or something like that. I don't really care uh, then it has two modems or two, sorry, Wi-Fi's on it. It has a 2.4 gigahertz. And so he says, if you're like outside of your house or in a room far away from the modem, then use that one. Uh, if you're close to the modem and you still want to use Wi-Fi, then use the five gigahertz one. So you can set up two different, uh, mo um, Wi-Fi's. And, uh, so I have to reset, redo all that when I get home. This is going to suck. Mm -hmm. 